Hello guys, uh, so in this video I wanted to talk about the benefits of uh, having an air stone in your fish tank. Well, there's lots of videos on YouTube about the benefits of air stone. Uh, lots of people will explain you that it's important to have an air stone which provides this column of uh, bubbles. Uh, these bubbles go up and they create this agitation on the surface and they saturate the water column with oxygen and this is basically what your fish need. And your fish really need oxygen in order to breathe so there's nothing you can argue with this statement well but is there any other ways to provide your fish with oxygen without actually having an air stone in your fish tank maybe you already have something in your fish tank that does provide oxygen so you don't really need to have this added air stone to your fish tank well this is my uh, 60 gallon 250 liter uh, planted um, scape it has uh, quite a lot of fish it's uh, relatively overstocked at the moment well some of this fish will be rehomed soon but it currently has about 50 small tetras it has a pair of uh, angel fish three apistos and two bristol nose plecos it certainly has some plants but there's not too many plants it's just i would say medium planted tank as you can see i don't have an air stone here there is no air stone here if you look at the fish they they breathe normally they don't gulp air at the surface they're not suffocating they don't even breathe heavily they, they just breathe as any fish should so why are my fish here feeling healthy they're not suffocating without air stone why are they feeling great plants maybe but not necessarily there are not too many plants in order to provide so much oxygen and Plants provide oxygen while there is a light. They don't provide oxygen at night. Well, the solution is quite simple. I have here an outlet from an external canister filter and it produces a certain amount of agitation on the surface. You can see that uh, this outlet pipe of my Fluval uh, canister filter, it provides quite a strong agitation at the surface. Everything is basically moving their waves on the surface. And this is what we need in order to create oxygen in water column. This surface agitation, it creates sufficient amount of oxygen in order for all this fish to live comfortably here without any air stone. I don't really need an air stone here because there's more than enough of this surface agitation at the moment and uh, definitely uh, air stone will be creating an extra agitation which is probably not necessary here and probably it, it is also not necessary in your fish tank as well so this is my other uh, fish tank it's a 60 liter tank and it also has no air stone in here it has this hang on the back uh, filter but no air stone it's not as heavily stocked as my other tank but it still has more than 10 neon tethers i think about 15 neon tethers i can't really remember uh, it has a pair of apistos and uh, about four juvenile bristol nose plecos they all breathe normally they are not suffocating they're feeling great i'm changing uh, water once per week and uh, there's no problems with oxygen here without an air stone so what provides oxygen uh, in this tank this particular water flow from uh, the hang on the back filter you can see that it creates this agitation on the surface which supplies sufficient amount of oxygen for the fish in this tank so there is no need for air stone in this tank our third tank it's also a 60 gallon tank about 250 liters it only has here a four item angels uh, and uh, one uh, juvenile bristol nose pleco it does have some uh, riparian plants growing with their roots in the water but it doesn't have any aquatic plants apart from the amazon frog bit on the sur water surface well uh, this tank actually has um, two air stones uh, one in each corner of the tank it also has three external canister filters all three of them with their outlets on top so well there's no spray bars but they provide quite a lot of agitation on the water surface all right so you might be asking yourself why do i need air stones here and all this surface agitation on top of the air stones provided by the external canister fi filters in this tank but not in my other tanks well the answer is simple this is uh 
Altum angel fish tank so the temperature has to be high it's currently at about 28 to 30 degrees celsius so when you keep fish at higher temperatures uh, there is higher requirement for oxygen and that's why we have to provide additional sources of oxygen yes if i had a lower temperature i could get away with uh, just the three outlets from the canister filters because they provide sufficient amount of water agitation and they create enough oxygen but because the temperature is high and these fish have high requirement for oxygen I have to provide additional sources of oxygen and that's why I have air stones here so the conclusion the conclusion of my video is that you definitely need more oxygen if you keep fish at higher temperatures if you keep fish at temperatures above 28 degrees celsius at about about 30 degrees celsius that's when uh, there is not sufficient amount of oxygen in your water column so you have to provide as much extra oxygen as possible this is when you keep discus when you keep uh, altum angels when you keep uh, german blue rams that's when you need extra oxygen and that's why you need to provide it otherwise uh, you can get away with your uh, external canister filters outflow if you have a spray bar it will provide more than enough oxygen in your fish tank unless the temperatures are high uh, if you have hang on the back filter and it has a flow water flow constant water flow creating surface agitation you will also have enough oxygen so you don't really need an air stone if you have an outlet of your canister filter in your fish tank and your water temperature is not too high so you would be able to have a stable tank with healthy fish without any air stone unless you either keep fish at high temperatures or you have heavily overstocked tank but as i've shown you in my other tank planted scape it it's quite heavily stocked but all fish are doing great without an air stone so definitely uh, to demonstrate you that you don't always need an air stone and you can have a healthy aquarium and healthy fish without adding an air stone i hope you liked the video please leave your comments in the comment section don't forget to subscribe and there will be more videos to come